Okay, uh, pick these up. You see it there. These, uh, pick, there's two of them. Pick this one up, pay $15 for this one. It was twelve fifty, but the person that picked it up for me, I gave them a, uh, just made it $15 even. I loosened up the uh, handlebars so I could haul it. All the bikes I own now are Mongoose. Mongoose is the household name. It's it's actually Mongoose said Walmart now, but a lot of people probably don't know, but. The gentleman that uh, created Mongoose, he's the first one to come out with mag rims and all that stuff, which I had one when I was younger. I really can't ride bikes anymore because of my hip. I got a couple, pl two plates and some screws. But when we go to Tennessee, it's flat. I can ride that around down there a little bit. This one's really got uh, some nice pedals on it. Uh, Brakes needs fixed. This, uh, actually, Let's see if we can fix these uh, brakes real quick here. Don't know if we can. That's screwed all the way in the way it looks. No, it's not. So the only thing I don't like about the newer style uh, bicycles, I got that these uh, adjustable. Uh, Brakes, they were the crap. There we go. That's how it's supposed to sit. I got that brake fixed. The other one you're going to see in a minute needs uh, more. This one needs a back wheel. Back wheels all loose. Then the air. This is more like a all around bicycle. You can see the cranks loose on this one. This would be good for a kid just to beat on. Pretty strong frame. Let's see. If I remember. These used to be like a 5 8 which they still are. And chain popped off. When I got when I got it, the chain wasn't on it. I just put it on right before I brought it in the garage here. Now change right. Chain's still way too loose while so I tighten that up. See if we can get these uh, things for the half working. Tires are completely fat on this one. That, that chain's still way too loose.
It actually might not be a 5 8 set. It's all loose. It might be metric now. But this will do just to move it around. Ain't too bad. Got that one. Let's see if the tires pump up on the first bike we got here. I don't even know if I got any air in my air compressor. Yeah, we got a little bit. These two probably ain't no good. The front is missing the brake shoes all together. The backs are on there. Looks like it's got a decent rim. It's got a... Uh, well, I can tell it's a one-piece rim. Some of your newer bicycles you get for kids and stuff, they weld it together. a little bit. And it looks like it, the original tire is the mongoose on the front. This back one, uh, probably not. This looks like a Walmart tire. It is. Walmart or off brand. But modern ones down there, I got five of these now. Got a newer one, now one down in Tennessee. And then I got these. I just put enough air in it to move it around. And I have to tighten this crank up. And uh, the one I got a hot, the one down there, down below, it's a girl's bike, so it's a mongoose. The bearings are going in that. I don't even know if I got a wrench big enough. Alright. Looks like I got a wrench big enough, but I gotta make sure that you take. Let's see if I can get this. You gotta take this middle one and turn that first. And these usually are usually backwards threads. They probably make a tool for this, but you can use a straight screwdriver. Loosen that back wheel back up. Loosen this up. You gotta get this crank fixed first. If the bearings are still in there. Seems like 
the bearings are in there, they just came loose. I think it might need new bearings on this one, same as the other one. I told you, I uh, was doing it wrong, it's backwards threads. You gotta go, you gotta take, like you're taking it off to put it on. So. Going the wrong way. That, it still needs fixed, but there we go. I'll go through and tear them all apart. I like to find myself... In the olden days, I used to ride bikes for 15 miles a day or more. I was a kid, I'd just go out and ride bikes. I used to ride over, I used to go over my, but there's one. I used to ride over my buddy's uh, mics and ride down that big hill. That was fun. Back then it was safe, you could do that. People watch out for you. Nowadays you get run over by a car. Alright, anyway that's the first one. Let's get the good one. Which I think is a good one. Let's bring that one in. This is a BMX freestyle. I don't know what it costs in or any on these, but and the way you tell on a freestyle, well, they call them. It's got a cable that goes down through the middle. This one had bumped up tires, but the brake handle is missing, so I got to get a brake handle. I'm going to try to get a mongoose one. I use one. All right. Pedals on this one are really, really good. So we need we need two sets of bearings. Now, I like these. These are aluminum. I had one when I was younger, I think it was pretty sure it was a mongoose when the first came out after I broke my leg at the time. Well anyway, I think that was steel. I don't remember. I'm gonna put these back in here. I took these out so I could spin the steering wheel. Make sure they're adjusted all the way down. And then just come through here and you grab this. You if you can. Usually grab that break and you can stick this back together. So all it's doing is grabbing the back brake. There's one. Now we gotta try to get the other side. Here's the other one. Then you can do a 360 or whatever they call it. Oh, I see what the problem is. It moved right here. Someone's got the adjustment so far out. I 
I don't know if I'm probably have to take it back apart. There we go. And then we'll feed that back in. Might be easier this time. There it is. So we need a one mongoose for a candle. But this one, tires seem good. Uh, I mean, pumped up. Tires are getting a little worn, but it'd be and it'd be nice if it was one of the seat. I need seat back here, so. But there's my two mongoose spikes. I, I paid 20 for this one, Mac Rance, and 15 for the other one. I know it ain't a car or a truck or whatever, or whatever else I was working on, but I like bikes too. So I said I got five of them now, mongooses. I'm gonna take them, take them and hang them around the walls and all in here so I get this done. So it'd be like wall art in a way. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a thumbs down. At least you watch one. And this is a mongoose mod. So I don't know what that is. Probably just a little higher end bike. Probably a two hundred dollar bike or something. If they sold them at Walmart, I don't know. All right, and thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and bye till later.